Pirate Chain is an up and coming crypto that uh, base uh, um, what what it does is it scrambles all all the numbers together, and no one knows which wallet it goes to and how many coins go to. It, and itself it offers uh, actually combined with uh, this decentralization itself it offers a lot of security and people find a lot of value in that and they think this is going to replace replace bitcoin so so uh, I, I would ask you guys if you guys have heard about pirate chain i have actually heard some other people talking about pirate chain but i haven't spent any time really looking into it and this is into... super new for me too yeah, I haven't I haven't done too much research into what it is. I'm also planning on taking a dive into BitTorrent tokens and seeing mm. what those look like as well. You know, BitTorrent something that I've well, something I've used and I feel like a lot of other people have as well. Um just, you know, for for my own for using my own uh, you know, using it for my own content consumption. Uh, I don't commercialize anything, but uh, it, it is something that I have utilized. And I think that a lot of other people have as well. You know, it's a decentralized uh, platform where you can uh, download different uh, software and movies and TV shows. And it's uh, completely free and you can uh, tip other users you can you know like what what other people it's just a it's a cool uh thing that's all that's been around for a very very long time and mm -hmm. uh BitTorrent tokens i think is just it's a a cool way to to use that platform to be able to uh provide some level of paying someone for the service that they're providing other users understood Understood. Which I'm I'm wondering if Pirate Chain could be something kind of similar just based on the name itself. How about we do this? How about we share the screen and we just do a quick Google search with a new tab. Let's go with share. Yeah, because I, I don't know. The price is so attractive, guys. The price is ridiculously attractive. It went from multiple cents to $7 within like recently. And it's expected to hit $50. So it's really doing a lot. Let's check it out pirate chain uh, and the symbol is r a r r r <laughs> <laughs> how fitting <laughs> right it, uh, yeah it's this guy r pirate chain r. <laughs> the most okay. anonymous cryptocurrency yeah that's their entire positioning that's how they want to kick bitcoins but that, that's their position pirate chain what is it the most anonymous cryptocurrency a truly private decentralized blockchain what is pirate a true privacy coin that takes financial privacy seriously pirate chain a r r r is a 100 percent private sent cryptocurrency it uses a privacy protocol pro protocol that cannot be compromised by other users activity on the network most privacy coins are riddled with holes created by optional privacy pirate chain uses is that 2k or zk zk Z pirate chain uses zk sharks to shield 100 percent of the peer-to-peer -peer transactions on the blockchain making for highly anonymous and private transactions are you guys familiar with zk snarks term no no neither am i yeah so, i'm not i'm not familiar with private chain either it must it might be an encryption protocol understood so that's what it, basically what i was trying to describe it scrambles the numbers you don't know who sent who how much right but i mean the, i mean and, and this you in the world that we live in today as mm -hmm. as we know uh, everything we think is private is not so true so true. i mean it's it's not i i don't care if it's encrypted if it's encrypted that's fine uh, i i don't believe that anything i do is 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 private anymore at least anything internet based mm -hmm. and, of, and of course now that i have you know uh i have alexa throughout the house oh. I, anything i do in private isn't isn't private anymore either nope. so yeah i i <laughs> to me saying that it's private it may be private to a peer-to-peer -peer. i'm sure gore mm -hmm. you probably couldn't see what i'm doing uh, mm -hmm. JT couldn't see what I'm doing, uh, but I can tell you right now the United States government sees everything that we're doing. Agreed. Whether we know it or not. 
And honestly, yeah. I'm glad. Simply because look at we're living in the best country in the world. If they were about to do the stuff that was going to be bad, I think we wouldn't have said that we're living in the best country in the world. If they don't do it, someone else is going to do it in a bad way and use it against, uh, I think, humanity. So I'd rather have it on, in, under good people's hands so they can have control of it. Uh, that's my personal opinion. Yeah, course. I mean, the reason behind the government, uh, you know, watching a lot of what we're doing, it has a lot of good reasoning for that. You know, it's uh, national security. There, there are go. a lot of people who talk about, you know, creating things that will hurt a lot of people. And it's important that uh, the government is able to track those people and make sure that any transaction that is created in order to buy something that could mm -hmm. be used as a weapon uh, is is watched. And that th those types of people do wind up on a watch list and they do uh, get targeted for surveillance. But I'll also say to the point about pirate chain is uh -huh. <laughs> if it is completely private if there is if they do believe that the government is not going to be able to track transactions the government will stop that they will regulate Ooh. that guaranteed it will become illegal in the united states if they aren't able to figure out a way that uh to be able to trace these uh these transactions right but i think that we saw the same thing happen with uh with verge as well XVG, it used to be considered like completely private or one mm -hmm. of the most private uh, digital currencies as well. And it's gone through uh, several stages of regulation. And a lot of older coins have seen that happen, especially the ones that a lot of their platform was based around how secure that they were, how private that they were. Right. Similar yeah. to Pirate Chain, basically. Yes. Yeah. Hmm. So I, I'd be careful I, uh -huh. if that's the if that's the primary reason uh, that you're investing, yeah, but anytime that somebody's pitch. thinking about <laughs> anytime that somebody's thinking about investing in something and they're excited and they're looking at the technicals and they're like, well, look how much that the graph has gone up. I'm like, well, if you want to invest, go ahead, but make sure that you only invest what you're willing to lose at that point, because mm -hmm. who knows mm -hmm. if you're already at the peak, you know, if, if it's right gone then? up recently parabolically, then just like I did with AMC stock. I got it at 1360 and I'm still waiting for it to go up so I can sell it. <laughs> <laughs> it's stuck at $10. Yeah. Yeah. No, exactly. 